if you are in the web client, um, so anybody that's on Business Central uh, Cloud obviously is in the web client. Um, the web client was available for on-prem, so I did work with some clients that opted to deploy the the Windows, uh, uh, the web client, I'm sorry, versus the Windows application. So if you're in the browser, uh, one of the, the chief sort of issues that I hear from people is, I don't like the mouse. I really want to uh, keep my hands on the keyboard. So what I wanna draw your attention to is if we go to uh, help and about uh, keyboard shortcuts, there are a lot of keyboard shortcuts that are available in the application uh, today. So in terms of moving across the menu structures and in, in terms of adding lines, um, copying records, all that sort of stuff, they're available and I can look at them um, online. Microsoft has put this nice little keyboard quick reference guide together here. And um, you know, this is just a, a condensed version of that, uh, which will show me, you know, how do I get to tell me more, opening my settings, uh, navigating, copy and paste. Um, the search capability is all accessible off of the keyboard uh, system versus the mouse. So if you've got users that are a little apprehensive or having some um, issues with, um, the keyboard, check this out somewhere in here. Oh yeah, right here. So there's a graphical printer friendly version, which I think is really cool. Uh, this little PDF, you could print it off um, and just give it to people. So they've got it right at their at their fingertips. One thing to note about uh, the release cycle. So we're in the midst of the April rollout now of Business Central. There are additional uh, keyboard shortcuts that Microsoft is making available. So. Um, I'm not sure that's probably the current list there, uh, but know that if you've got an older one that you printed, print them again, um, you can make use of the, uh, the new updates.